Hello, it's Solimik. Today in the morning, I start my car and have check engine light. So whenever you have check engine light, it's important to have OBD scanner to scan the car to see what is the error code that makes check engine light turn on. Most of the time, they are easy fix. I usually use this CG solid OBD scanner. It's easy for connecting and fast. So I'm gonna insert it in OBD port which is located under the steering wheel. We are gonna go to read code and then stored code. And we have PO102 which is the mass airflow sensor. You either have disconnected wire harness, damaged wire or just need cleaning. So I'm just gonna quickly check the wire and the wire harness for any damage. In this case it's all good. So I'm gonna remove it and clean it. We gonna need a Phillips screwdriver, disconnect the wire harness and remove the two screws. Now we can pull the sensor out and have a look. If we look closely, these thin wires are the sensors and it has something on it. You do not want to use any brush or something sharp on it to remove that dirt. These thin wires are very sensitive and they can be damaged very easily. So I'm gonna use CRC Mass Airflow Sensor Cleaner to clean the sensor. What's special about this cleaner that doesn't leave any residue after cleaning the sensor unlike other cleaners. Any leftover residue will cause an accurate reading for the sensor. So we're gonna give it some time to dry and then put it on the engine. So I found one of the filter box clips was open and letting unfiltered air enter without getting filtered. That's why I had that dirt on the sensor. Alright, the mass airflow sensor is dry. We're gonna put it back and screw it on. Then we're gonna put the wire harness back. Now I'm gonna erase the code and start the engine. If the same code comes back again, we have to replace mass airflow sensor. Alright, it's been day 2 and I didn't have any check engine light. So with the help of OBD scanner, mass airflow sensor cleaner and screwdriver, we could fix this problem at home. So I hope you guys found the video useful and learned something new. If it was, like and subscribe if you haven't already. And I will see you in the next one. Bye for now.